friends, welcome to this first in a series of short instructional videos on how to pray the Anglican Rosary. The purpose of this first video is really just basic introduction and orientation to the Anglican Rosary. Now, the Rosary, as you can see, is a set of prayer beads, and it is designed to bring us into contemplative or meditative prayer or mindfulness. That is to say, being aware of being in the presence of God. The basic idea is that as you pray, your fingers hold and touch the beads, and you say a prayer or a sentence from Scripture as you move from one bead to the next. The touching of the fingers on each successive bead is an aid in keeping our mind from wandering, and the rhythm of the prayers leads us more readily into stillness. Just by way of demonstration here, I'm going much faster than I would be if I were actually praying, but I just want to show you how basically you move from one bead to the next. I'd recommend uh, holding the rosary, uh, the beads, uh, between the thumb and forefinger of your dominant hand. And as you go through, you can pull each bead sort of back towards you. Uh, there's space here in between them. I want to explain just briefly the uh, numerical symbolism of the rosary. The Anglican prayer uh, beads, the Anglican rosary, has 33 beads. That is fewer than uh, its counterparts in the Roman Catholic and Eastern Orthodox traditions. You start here with the cross, and that is a reminder that it is through the cross of Christ, his death and resurrection, that we enter into the life of God and into the life of prayer. This next bead here right above it, this one, is called the invitatory. That's where you say a prayer of introduction or where you express your intention for praying the entire rosary. And then from there you enter into the circle, and the first bead you'd come to is the first of the four cruciform beads. One, two, three, and four. They're called the cruciform because, of course, together they form a cross. And those are set apart from the rest by a bit of a space, uh, because you say a different prayer on those ones than you would on these. As for these, these are called the weeks. You have four sets of seven beads. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The number seven is uh, very important in the Bible uh, because God made the world in six days and rested the seventh, as it says in the book of Genesis. And so therefore in the scriptures, the number seven represents Sabbath rest and completion wholeness and perfection. And just so, as we pray the rosary, we enter into a Sabbath rest, you might say. So if you were to add up all these beads, four sets of seven, that's 28, plus four more for the cruciform, that's 32, uh, plus the final one here, the invitatory or the dismissory bead, which you pray on your way out, the total is 33. And that is traditionally believed to be the number of years in the earthly life of Jesus. So that's just some basic introduction and orientation. The next video uh, will be on how actually to pray uh, the beads, uh, focusing on intentional breathing. Thanks for joining us, and please come back for the next one.